The Reef has got many trading platforms and one of them is the Reef X. So in today's video I'll be reviewing this new interface for the Reef X. So uh, this is my first time trying this trading platform. So I'm going to start from this side. Okay, so this is like the name MetaTrader 5 for the first time. So in today's video we're going to find out if this platform is better than MetaTrader 5 or the other platforms the Rive has. So let's start with the left side. So the left side had to go to all the indices, okay? Even the volatility indices are here. Okay. then this is our chart so let me see i think so from here we can change the chart type okay this is good that's the same uh then from here i don't know what this is oh i now get it is this comma one okay then from here <coughs> okay so when you click here it shows you like the current price okay this is nice okay okay so this one we can draw some trend lines and okay, either enter a price line a rectangle let's try out this one and see how it is okay so when i try to draw okay this seems to be good than i thought <coughs> so, okay and it's actually easier let's try the up arrow let's see okay so the only thing i'm kind of liking so far is the these is this graphical um okay so um so i'm done with the chart so from here okay so here is where i think this is where you change the time frame from so i don't know if it's the one okay so i am now on a five minutes time frame oh yeah so you can as well change from here so this is a one minute time frame okay then what else can we do so when i click here ah okay so when you click there now you enter into full screen wow now this looks more awesome than i thought okay so this is more nicer okay now how do i exit this full okay so we simply click here again <coughs> and now when you come at the right side right side okay there are many uh symbols here is volatility 10 volatility 25 volatility 15 so i can either place a sale or a buy uh i'm not really liking this one over here and i'm sure i can remove it okay so now like how do you enter a trade on this one okay so one of the ways simply right click and click buy so this pair or this currency or, or this index is volatility 75 then you have to choose the lot size you want okay by the way this is a demo account then i have to choose if either i'm buying or selling okay and I, i'm not seeing where i can choose if this is a buy limit or a sell limit oh i can change from here okay so i can choose here if it's a limit a stop or at market price so in this case let's try to buy or sell at market price then click on send order okay then here on the right side on the top right side i'm able to see the profit of those <coughs> so let's see how it goes okay and i'm able to see the margin of course oh I can as well like scroll okay this is good okay so while we are waiting for this trade 
for the result if to be a profit or a loss let's check out other features first of all let me try to zoom in how do you zoom in okay so i'm currently like i'm using an external mouse to zoom in and zoom out okay this is good but i'm sure there must be some buttons for zooming in or zooming out there's supposed to be somewhere okay so we're currently in negative 1.97 so while we're waiting for the results let's check out other features so what are some other features so when you click on the trading dashboard okay so this is like okay these analytics are good so you'll be able to see like the average winning trade holding time average losing trade holding time percentage retain risk reward ratio okay this is nice okay so from here trading journal oh and it also comes with the trading journal already so this is good because you do not need to start using other external trading journals which will eventually like force you to pay a subscription so you can as well like from here you can go to technical analysis so what's on technical analysis i think it's just the same thing where you can add up a bunch of indicators draw some stuff and so on okay now this is more complex than i thought okay let me go back to my trading account okay currently i'm now in profit of dollar i don't know 0.0 14 cents okay let me see on meta trader 5 i can just drag this to change the okay it's not working <coughs> so let's try some other stuff so let me try to click on positions okay so this is how it is okay so now let's try to close this trade how do you do that okay fortunately i'm clicking here it's not showing anything so let me try to click on positions maybe i'll be able to close from here ah <laughs> okay this is complex this is more harder than i thought maybe i'm going to trading dashboard i'm not here uh, okay okay I, I found it <clears throat> so simply click on positions and go to your right sidebar and click on the position and right click then we're able to modify if we'd like to add your stop loss or you take profit or if we'd like to close or create an alert as you can as well create an alert this is now more awesome okay so now i'm already in profit so uh, let me just close this okay so this was actually a good entry than I thought okay I wish I used a lot size and I wish this was a real account okay one dollar point six five that's some good money so let me close this one before I end up in losses okay I'm closing this position okay so this trading platform is actually good than i thought so let's try to find out some other stuff we can do here okay let's see so on here you'll be let's try to click on orders and see what's here okay i think here you'll be able to see some live positions and some orders unfortunately there's nothing let's try to click on other history okay so this will be able to see my past trades okay this is good so this is my other history okay from here let's try cash movements what's here so on cash movements okay so the cash movement is this one here on the down right bottom okay so i'll be able to see if i've withdrawn if i've deposited okay so this is good it's like everything you want is in here let's try some okay let's see what's on messages
okay messages currently nothing probably these are messages from the broker let's go on those ah, those have already done this um okay what about here what's here okay so here there's just opening live account account statement oh i can also change to right mode ah no this is more painful to the eyes okay i am enjoying the dark mode okay okay so this is it about this video about reviewing the roof x so what is the conclusion okay so the conclusion is this part from better than meta 5 <coughs> well meta 5 is still the best but this platform has got some other features meta 5 does not have okay so it's just that i am used to meta 5 and going back to this platform is going to be a bit hard because it would be more like the first time when you went into meta trader trading like you have to you have to start learning the trading platform how to draw stuff how to place a trade how to modify and so on okay so this platform may look very complex it's actually easier and there's a lot of features which can really help you in trading okay so as for me i think i'm going to start learning how to use this platform better like get more experience get more uh, knowledge about it okay there's a lot of features i've always wanted to have of which meta trader 5 does not have so if you learned something from this video give it a like for more videos like this go on and subscribe so to the link to this will be in the description so this is actually a demo account so bye for now see you in the next video tomorrow